Hey guys, Dr. Linda Kramer. Thank you so much for watching. Today, tarot. What's today's date? The 26th of the 6th, 2022. Twice I've done a tarot spread today. And I honestly cannot be the bearer of bad news. So I'm not doing a tarot spread today. One of the stone, you know how I get a ruined stone? Twice I tried to do a tarot spread today and I got the same ruined stone. It is the hail stone. Devastation is coming. <clears throat> But remember what happens with hail. It is bad when it hits, but the ice melts and it gives life to the wildlife as well as the plant life because it is ultimately water. So the other things that I got today, I got two times. I got the same tarot card and it is the um, Queen of Cups. This represents a woman who is extremely busy running around looking after everybody else. And I think that's what I want to concentrate on today, guys. I don't want to concentrate on the devastation that is upon us. I want to think about the Queen of Cups because she is the one who is ultimately the one out there helping others. I'll be honest with you guys in the last three days I've had seven people die seven in three days five of them were confirmed that they just had a certain medical procedure We cannot say any more that it is coming. The hailstone, I only had it a few weeks ago as well. The truth is now being put into our reality. Let's go there with that one. If you know what I'm fault, fault of talking about here, guys. Because at this point, if you're not on the bench with this and you don't want to fathom or believe what has happened over the past two years, then it's no longer my or anyone else's responsibility to try and wake you up. Because you're about to experience it. <laughs> I've just had seven deaths in 36 hours. It's not nice it's not nice at all but every time I did the cards this morning all the messages that I was getting was it is now here it's not coming anymore it is now upon us so we've got to stay focused we've got to stay loving we've got to stay compassionate and most of all show the grace of God to others including those who created this whole mess seven years ago if you've listened to my prophecies if you've emailed me and said Linda what's happening in over the 2023 to 2025 period because hundreds have emailed me asking about my prophecies and I've been very honest and raw there I was told that three and eight will perish three and eight I never understood that until about a year or so ago when I saw this report that said that the world population was now eight billion people so that's like half so let's just go there guys find your tribe reach out to people it doesn't mean that you have to live with them it doesn't mean that you have to be in the same street with them or work with them one of the lovely ladies who's in my tribe lives in Wisconsin, USA, and I'm in Brisbane, Australia. We talk on FaceTime over messen on mes um, Messenger on Facebook, I should say. 
So we do video calls, FaceTime calls on Messenger. And it's like she's in the room with me, but I just can't physically hug her. So we've got to find our tribe, those who are supporting us, those who are believing us, those who are wanting the best for us. If you've got people in your life that don't fit into those three categories, consider your involvement with those three, those people. Because at the end of the day, we should always be understanding, supportive, and most of all, encouraging and loving. Okay? So I've been getting attacked by certain relatives, as well as people who I thought were friends. And at the end of the day, we're now at a point where we can no longer tell them what the reality of the situation is. They need to work it out on their own and hopefully find something that will prevent what's coming, if you're following what I'm saying. So guys, there's no tarot today. I'm really apologising because I don't like being unreliable. I've had a lot to deal with, obviously, with people ringing me, crying, upset, etc. Understandably, especially when children are involved. Um, and I've also got to have a chat with my daughter when she gets home today because one of those people was one of her teachers. So imagine how she's now going to feel because it's personal to her as well. And I don't want her to be too upset by this because she's got to be strong and get through the next couple of years because by then she'll be only 18 years old and imagine the future in front of her. So that's something for us to all to consider, guys, darlings, I nearly called you all. Think about where you want to be in two years. You know, COVID's been here now for two years and it's gone pretty damn fast when you look back. So imagine another two years because we're nearly about halfway through this now. But the next two years is going to be extremely hard, extremely painful for many. Please know that um, if you do feel hopeless, if you do feel that you just can't go on anymore, I've got my email below. You can catch me on Messenger. If you know my phone number, if you're in Australia, you're quite welcome to ring me or go and talk to someone. Go and see a doctor and just let them know, okay? Because at the end of the day, no one is ever alone. No one is ever alone. You know, I, I lie in bed at night and I think about all the houses in my street and I think about how many people are in each house and it's only feet to where people sleep. So we're never truly alone. We've always got people within 10 feet of us, really, when you think about it, okay? Or if even if you go to 50 feet, unless you're out on acreage or, hello, you live on an island in the middle of the Pacific, wouldn't that be nice? I need that right now. Um, but at the end of the day, guys, you're never alone. So reach out and talk to someone. Find the tribe, okay? Find your unit and it doesn't mean it's blood because family doesn't mean that they're friends however friends can be family okay so I do apologize again there's no tarot today but please know that we are now in it there's no going back now you know food shortages are going to continue look at how many factories are getting burnt down in America Something like 35 they've, they've burnt down. They're doing this deliberately to us, guys. The chemtrails over Australia at this point, my God, it's ridiculous how many chemtrails we've got. Everyone's sick. Um, I, I haven't been well for four weeks, but I think that's more an energetic attack because um, that's been going on. Um, body aches. How many people out there have got body aches? Uh, sore necks or arms or throat. So head, hello. I actually said to someone the other day, I'm a walking zombie doll, big um, voodoo doll. That's what I feel like. I'm a walking voodoo doll, and someone's got a, a sword, and they're just throwing it in me because it was just instant pain, and then it would go away. 
how would you know it's not someone's made of me made that of me so if you have i don't give you permission okay karma comes back to us remember okay if we do the right things karma's always comes back to us we must remember that we must remember that because bad times are before us hunker down guys do what makes you happy find your happiness find your passion find your center or your core okay what was that movie oh um guardians um oh my god i can't remember the movie what it's called guardians but it was about um jack um and the easter rabbit was in it <laughs> easter bunny was in it that was jack human hugh jackman hugh jackman played the rabbit um Jude Law was in it. He played the nightmare guy. Um, can't remember the name of it. Guardians of the something. But you've got to find your center and you've got to find out who you are on the inside. Because all this materialistic world, our lives, you know, so many people put so much onus on their life as being a materialistic existence. But it's not. We come here to learn. We come here to learn and grow okay we come here to experience the worst case scenarios so we appreciate the euphoria of heaven we come here to learn how to grieve so then we understand the value of love hope that's helped you today guys comment below email me if you have to i don't mind find me on messenger okay facebook messenger i'm under linda ray r-a-e is my middle name okay um we're never alone that's the message for today hunker down and start looking after us okay ourselves have a good week guys do another tarot soon bye To learn more about your Solistic Alignment, please press the like button and click subscribe. To purchase any of Dr. Linda Kramer's books or services, please visit www.lindaray.info.